Did you know that your SQL queries are actually costing you money? And did you know that it costs more money to write inefficient queries than it does to write efficient queries? If you use a cloud-based data warehouse like Snowflake, BigQuery, or Databricks, you are literally billed for your queries. And the amount that you are billed depends on factors like how long it takes your query to run and how much data needs to be scanned per query. But if you use a traditional database like MySQL, Postgres, or SQL Server, you pay in performance. Here's an example. Let's say you have a small query that only takes about five minutes to run, but it needs to be run every single day. That adds up to about 20 hours a year or about half a working week. So if small queries that run relatively quickly can add up to a substantial amount of time, think about the impact that massive queries would have. You or your company could easily spend hundreds of thousands of dollars just in time spent waiting for SQL queries to execute. This is why it is so important to learn how to write SQL code correctly. Simple rules like not pulling more data than is necessary and not sorting your data unless you actually need it sorted can go a long way in saving you or your company thousands of dollars a year. If you want a full list of simple and effective ways to write efficient SQL queries, hit the follow button so you don't miss the tips in the next video.